is up? Hopefully you guys are having a wonderful day. Back with some more Resident Evil 4 remake gameplay for you. And today I'm going to show you guys why the tower is still easily usable and extremely viable. Especially if you're having difficulty beating the demo. Uh, I heard a lot of people say that, oh, since you can fall through the tower, there's no point in going up there. And it's a beginner's trap. Well, maybe this is the first time. But once you realize, hey, you can still go up there and still use it. Um, it's something that... It's extremely viable. It can help people out. They're having trouble doing this thing, doing this mode. I, as I said, I'm not doing it on Mad Chainsaw mode, but I'm pretty sure you could do it very easily up there too as well. So basically, I have the TMP, I have the shotgun, I have the handgun. You don't necessarily need all of those weapons, but at the very least, you need your knife. You need at least a shotgun. I say get the shotgun at least. And what you want to do is, you, when you climb up the ladder, you know, make sure your shortcuts are done right. You also want to have a grenade or two. That helps as well. But you want to stand right here. You don't want to go over to the right. Stand right here. And if it's the Dr. Salvador, the Chainsaw Maniac, shoot him with a TMP or shotgun. You can do the handgun, but it's for these. It's easier to get him down. And he'll fall down take the fall damage. And when it's the normal Ganados, as they come up here, you just knife them. It's as simple as that. You know, there's not really any too much to it. Just knife the normal Ganados, save some ammunition, and you know they might get stumbled up there, but they'll fall eventually. And if you have a little leeway here, you know if they're not coming up for a while, you can also toss a grenade down there. But as I said, switch over to TMP or shotgun for Dr. Salvatore and say toss a grenade. Be careful when you're tossing a grenade there, because sometimes a Ganado coming up might bounce it back at you and hit you up here. So that's happened to me a few times, but. You know, just want to be safe and secure. It seems like the only thing I have to fear is myself, <laughs> damaging myself. But basically, it's real simple. Just keep doing this, and eventually, I thought he's gonna get stuck up here, but he gets knocked over by the other Ganado. But eventually, just like that, bam! And as soon as you hear the bell, just hop down there real quick and get all the points before the, the demo ends and get your score up there. And bam! It's a, it's as simple as that. So yeah, the tower is easily usable and hopefully that can help people out. As I said, I haven't tried on Mad Chainsaw mode difficulty, but I'm pretty certain it's a similar thing. You might want to do the stealth route with just getting the TMP of all the ammunition and at least pick up a grenade or two and get the shotgun. But overall, it's it's pretty easy to do. Just get to the tower and you're set. But that is going to be it. Hopefully this helps you guys out and hopefully I can see you guys back in the next video. Thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day and I hope to see you all later. Peace.